Hi there, this is Ranjit and in this uh, video, I'm going to talk about the OnePlus 3T, which is the new Android smartphone from OnePlus. And this is a successor to the very popular OnePlus 3. And in terms of uh, looks, it's almost identical to the OnePlus 3. But in terms of specs, uh, OnePlus has bumped up the specs a little bit. And we're going to compare the specs uh, with the OnePlus 3 in this uh, video. And as you can see from the spec sheet, uh, uh, the biggest uh, thing is that now it comes with the new Snapdragon 821 uh, uh, chipset, which is clocked slightly higher compared to the older one. On the new one, uh, the powerful cores are clocked at 2.35 gigahertz, whereas on the older one, they were clocked at 2.15 gigahertz. Again, both of them are quad core. Moving to RAM, uh, even the 3T has six gigabytes of RAM, so there is no change. But when it comes to storage, we see a massive uh, bump. Actually, the OnePlus 3T will come in two variants, 64, and also there'll be a new variant that will come with 128 gigabytes of uh, storage. Moving to camera, here we see uh, huge changes. Moving to the first, let's talk about the front facing camera. On the older OnePlus 3, we had an eight megapixel front facing camera. Whereas on this new OnePlus 3T, we have a 16 megapixel front facing camera. So it looks like great for selfies. Now, if you move to the rear facing camera, though the 3T also has a 16 megapixel rear facing camera, but this one has a new Sony IMX298 sensor. So it'll be interesting to see how is the uh, camera performance when we compare it with the older OnePlus 3? And I'm really excited to see and check out uh, how it improves in camera performance. Now, moving to another improvement that we have on the newer OnePlus 3T compared to the older OnePlus 3 is in terms of battery capacity. The new 3T will have a 3400 milliamp hour battery, whereas this old OnePlus 3 has a 3000 milliamp hour battery. And again, we still have that uh, quick dash charging even with the OnePlus 3T. So in my uh, frank opinion, uh, it should now, the new one 3T should last for a, a full typical day without any issue. So that's a welcome move, I, I would say. So biggest improvements I would say uh, is in terms of camera performance and also in terms of battery. Now, if we talk about uh, the colors, uh, this uh, new one will also come in two uh, colors. That's the gunmetal and the soft gold. And moving to the screen, again, still uh, there were rumors that OnePlus might ditch AMOLED, but that's not the case. As you can see from the specs, uh, it's still having a 5.5 inch 1080p AMOLED uh, screen. So still we are having a 5.5 inch AMOLED screen. So I would say this OnePlus 3T is a sort of a plus model compared to the OnePlus 3. So if you already have a OnePlus 3, nothing to be disappointed about. OnePlus 3 is still a very good device. Uh, so, but again, now this uh, new OnePlus 3T has uh, technically it should have slightly better battery life and also we have to see how improved are the cameras uh, regarding the pricing oneplus has bumped up the pricing a little bit now with this oneplus 3t uh, for example uh, in us dollars if we convert it will be about 437 dollars as of now uh, at the time of making this video oneplus india hasn't announced any pricing details Whenever they do that, I'll have the uh, link and updated info in the YouTube show notes. Also, I would suggest that you, uh, ha I'll put the link of Phone Radar blog. Uh, they will also update their blog with the latest uh, info regarding India release and the pricing. But again, expect the pricing to be a little bit, uh, what do you say, uh, increased compared to the OnePlus 3. Uh, we are speculating pricing around the 30 to 32,000. Again, we'll know all the uh, details when OnePlus 3 India officially announces it. And another thing that uh, we are hearing is that OnePlus 3 might be discontinued and this OnePlus 3T will replace that model. So guys, uh, what do you think about this OnePlus uh, 3T? Are you excited about that or not? Frankly speaking, I'm looking forward to test the camera performance of this OnePlus 3T. And it'll be really interesting to see if uh, the new camera on the OnePlus 3T can compete with the flagship uh, Android uh, smartphones. So guys, that's it for now for this uh, very quick specs overview of the OnePlus 3T. And if you're not subscribed to my YouTube channel, hit that subscribe button. Thanks for watching. This is Ranjit and I hope to see you in my next video.